Okay, so I really wanted to show you this full animation and the full process of how I created it. It's sped up, but honestly, it really doesn't take that long to create something like this. The speed with which you can do this is unheard of in the traditional way of 3ds Max plus V-Ray, for example. The only issue I had is that my hard drive crashed right in the middle of creating this project. So I actually have created multiple versions of the same project because I lost several days worth of work. I lost several of the time-lapse videos of creating the project. So the key takeaway for me is that once you learn a good workflow, Unreal Engine can be fast, it can be intuitive, and it can feel extremely creative, but it is also extremely hardware intensive and resource heavy. In fact, I think me maxing out my computer with Screen recording and running Unreal Engine might have contributed to my hard drive just completely crapping out. So learning the workflow and getting good enough hardware, that's the hard part. Creating cinematic animations in Unreal Engine, that part is incredible. Let's check it out.
Thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about my process, check the links below for my Unreal Engine course with the YouTube discount. It's super cheap and way easier than trying to figure it all out on your own. And like I said, once you get that workflow down, it isn't that hard after that. And if you want more free info on working in Unreal Engine or just working in ArcViz in general, subscribe to this channel because I have a lot more to say on those subjects in the upcoming weeks and months. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next video.